Morning from Power Gardens. How are you guys today? Just thought I'd bring on a uh, subject that a lot of people have been talking about and asking questions about how do you grow your uh, peppers. So I use uh, Jiffy plugs and uh, put seeds inside the plugs and they sprout like what we've got in front of you here. So these are my um, uh, new ones today that I'm going to show you how I separate. So basically what I do take uh, the plug with the seeds in it, I take a pair of scissors and uh, do the snip and basically cut straight through to the bottom. That allows me to peel the outside skirt off. Pretty easy really, it's nice and simple, no, no strenuous effort I can you know, at, at all. Just put that uh, skirt aside. So that's what we're looking at with your um, plants here. So the seedlings are quite healthy. So at the moment, just using my finger and my thumb, uh, just one hand next to the other, gently squeezing in the center. And you can see, as long as the plug is nice and moist, it will separate very, very easily. So basically that's your first one. We'll just lie them down there so that we can see what we're gonna do. And see how the roots are coming through in the centre there. These tiny little roots, you cannot disturb them. So the idea is to take the excess of that and basically wrap it around that root so that it does not get harmed when you transplant it. So what I do here is I just push into the centre just so it covers it. Now you can uh, put your hand into the position where it cups everything and holds it nice and gently. You can pat it all down. A bit of moisture actually helps. So if you squeeze the moisture out, that shapes it, and that's ready to go into your plug or into your um, your planter, your new pot. So that's that one. That one looks okay too. So both of them are pretty uh, pretty wet. They're nice and moist so that the the roots are happy and healthy when they go into the new new home. So just going to shape that. So now we have the, um, the bag. Uh, we put the name on the outside already. And um, what I'm going to do here is just press it down so it's nice and firm. And there's no, no tricks. Basically you just put your plug in. Press down, releases some of the moisture into the actual open bag. Now the next thing is just to backfill it with some more. I've got another bag here with some soil in it already. And basically I'm just going to backfill it so that the soil will hold the plant nice and still. As the roots grow, it'll come back nice and strong, nice and happy, nice and healthy. And... Um, that's what it's all about. So we're just looking after what we can at the moment to hope and uh, well give it a lot of um, support to grow nice and big and strong, grow my baby. So that's the basics of what we do to get our seedlings started. Uh, this one has been started uh, under a light inside. So um, it needs to be hardened up when it goes out into the uh, outside community in the greenhouse or the outdoors where you live so this is just getting them started getting them prepared for a new lease of life now he's looking pretty healthy how's that ready to go so that's the first one here's the next one yep ready and waiting I'll just make that hole a bit bigger in there and we can slide that whole root ball in hopefully fit nicely. Look at that. So, just going to add a bit of backfill in there. Just pack down on the top. We don't really want to disturb the roots if we can help it. Because they're the um, they're the big machine of the uh, plant that's going to soak up everything and uh, anything that you give it. So if you look after it right now it's going to perform really well for you. So, 
Normally, once you uh, get everything set up inside your new planter, it's a good idea to water them. So um, my root balls are all already nice and moist. So pretty much what I do, just squeeze the moisture in the root ball so it actually surrounds the inside soil. So that gives a good contact against the roots. So that's ready to go now. There you go. How's that? Have a great day, everyone. There's uh, two ready to go. Ooh, yeah, baby.